Hello I'm a Mac. And I'm a PC, and I just finished editing another home movie. Wow, you did another one just as I made another one of my own home movies using iMovie. Of course, it was fast and easy to do. Well I still doubt it's as excellent as mine, but I'm always happy to take a look. Wait a minute. You didn't use Cyberlink PowerDirector again, did you? Because they now make a version of that for the Mac as well. Nope. I used Microsoft's newest video editing application bundled with Windows 11. This will be good. But let's play in mine first. Roll it. 432 beep. Hi, I'm a Mac Home Movie. Of course, mine still looks pretty professional. Indeed it does. And now let's watch my home movie. I hope it's really cheesy and amateurish. Hello, I'm a PC home movie produced on Microsoft's ClipChamp. Wait a minute, ClipChamp has professional features. How can it be? Yeah, it's pretty amazing. It's very similar to your iMovie, except I can work with more than just two video tracks, allowing for better video layer compositing, and I can even create text-to-speech voice tracks using ClipChamp. Well, can it also work with 4K video? Well you have to pay a cheap subscription to get that, but again, it's still similar to buying a feature-packed third-party video editing application like PowerDirector. A subscription? Huh. A movie in Final Cut Pro do not require subscriptions. But the one for ClipChamp is very affordable, and worth it to have decent easy multi-track 4K video editing on a Windows PC. Oh geez, you're still coming up to standards with us Macs for audio-visual production. And that's not all, I'm even in a relationship with an old home movie that was edited in the old Microsoft Photos video editing feature. Come on in, honey. Sup. PC home movie made on the now discontinued Microsoft Photos movie editor. Our relationship is a work in progress.